let's look at mode as a measure of central tendency. Mode is among the most common used me measures of central tendency. Yeah, mode is a measure of central tendency that looks at the most occurring item. It looks at the item that occurs many times compared to other items. And like mean, mode is not affected by extreme figures or extreme values. Values that are extremely big, they do not affect mode. So mode look, it looks at that item that has appeared more than once or that has appeared many times compared to other items. Let's look at the advantages of mode. First is that it is easy to calculate and understand. Secondly, it can be located merely by inspection in some cases because you just look through the figures and know which, which one has appeared many times than the others. Then it is not affected by extreme values. Disadvantages of mod. First is that it is not unique because you can have more than one item appearing like frequent times when they're all appearing maybe five five times so it is not unique you can have more than one mode then it is not based on all observations of the distribution since you only look out of that item that has appeared many times another disadvantage is that it is not suitable for math further mathematical treatment mm, like mod we only just get it and that is it like it is not used in any other formula or words we do not use it it's not like mean then it is affected affected to a greater extent by sampling fluctuations <laughs>